I've been involved in fishing 35 years, and Elizabeth, my wife, she's born into a fishing family, so we're fishing, fishing, fishing um, forever. <laughs> We've owned the Britannia two and a half years now, and it's a gill netter. It's my part of the job to keep the thing up to scratch, everything in date and so on, and it's very much the skipper mix responsibility as, as to where he goes fishing, when he goes, what he catches, and so on and so on. As the skipper of the vessel, the book stops with me for everything. We work uh, five crew and myself aboard the boat. We've been involved with the responsible fishing scheme for some years now in the old scheme. And just this year there was talk of the new scheme and we've been involved in really testing how it's going to work. There's a certain amount of self-discipline involved and for me it's quite a good thing because it means that I do things in a systematic way and things don't get forgotten. On the health and safety, certainly the whole boat has got to be up to standard for its um, safety certificate which is issued by the MCA. The big change in this scheme is the crew ethical and the welfare of the crew making sure they're paid properly, and their living quarters, living conditions are as comfortable as possible. Make the skipper, certainly he'd be involved in training and induction in cases of a new crew member. Just so they're up to date, what would you do if? We have training exercises regularly, about once a month, fire drills and safety procedures. I have to report in to DEFRA to start the trip and they're reporting at least once a day. At the end of the day someone's going to eat this fish and I want them to enjoy it so we've got to look after the quality. Care of the catch, box it properly, ice it properly, make the skipper he would be looking at the temperature of a fish room and logging that down. care of the environment is, again, one of the main principles of this scheme and as a fisherman. It's vitally important to me because if we don't look after the environment, then we, we've got no future. Anything that we produce in the way of waste has got to be collected, kept on board and disposed of once we get ashore. In terms of avoidance of cetacean bycatch, dolphins, we have pingers that are put on the gear. the Responsible Fishing Scheme makes me meet a certain standard of how the boat is run, I think. That's the simplest way of putting it. Lives are involved. It's a responsible business, and everyone should take it seriously.